Dogs are considered to be man's best friend, but there are dozens of different breeds out there, each with its unique personality traits and features. But the dog we are going to talk about today is an absolute cutie. Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we are going to tell you about the Golden Retriever and why this goodest boy girl can make an amazing pet for you. So let us begin. Dudley Majori Banks, who lived in the Highlands of Scotland in the late 1800s, is responsible for the Golden Retriever's evolution. He bought Naus in 1865 from a cobbler close to Brighton, a town in southern England. In a litter of black wavy coated retrievers puppies, only one yellow pup was born in 1864. This young puppy had been entrusted to the cobbler by Lord Chichester's gamekeeper as payment for a debt owed to the local landowner. This young pup travelled with Majori Banks to Gissiken, his farm in Scotland, to join his kennel of sporting dogs. Like many of the gentry at the time, Majori Banks had a particular interest in raising both canines and high quality animals. His personal goal was to create a superior retriever suitable for the Scottish climate. Topography and types of accessible games led to his interest in retrievers. Numerous yellow puppies from Nouse's matings with Bell, a tweed water spaniel between 1864 and 1871, served as the ancestors of a rare breed of yellow retrievers. The kennel records that were kept at Gissiken and are presently in the Kennel Club Library include generations of these and later breedings. The offspring of Naus and Bell were crossed with flat and wavy coated retrievers, a second tweed water spaniel and a red setter. To carry on his line, Majori Banks generally retained the yellow puppies and a few black ones. These dogs served as the ancestors of what we now know as the lovable golden retriever. Now, let us talk about some of the advantages of owning this amazing dog. Because of their easygoing disposition and upbeat demeanor, golden retrievers give the impression that they may not be particularly intelligent. However, the findings show us that among the 10 most intelligent dog breeds, golden retrievers come in at number four. Other researchers demonstrated that the golden retriever's capacity for learning extends well beyond its formal schooling. They are as intelligent as a two-year-old child and are capable of learning up to 165 words. These dogs are pretty easy to train. The reason why golden retrievers are among the easiest dogs to train is because of their intelligence and outgoing nature. They should begin receiving instruction at the age of eight weeks and it should continue throughout their lives. When you purchase a golden retriever puppy, you can begin training him as soon as he gets home. Breeders typically start their socialization training while they're still with their mother, though. Additionally, keep in mind that your golden retriever will enjoy training. This is an opportunity for the two of you to connect and establish a solid relationship. Another huge advantage of owning this dog is that they are extremely good with families. A golden retriever can be the ideal dog for you if you have kids in your home. Golden retrievers make the perfect family dog since they are inherently protective and compassionate. However, it is important to remember that golden retrievers are a larger breed of dog and their exuberance may have some drawbacks in that it is simple for them to inadvertently knock over or damage a youngster. But this isn't really a big deal. Golden retrievers are ideal canines for your children if they are under your supervision and are well trained. The outstanding character of a golden retriever is undoubtedly a plus but adaptability is also crucial. Any kind of family or home will be welcoming to a golden retriever. A golden retriever may spend time alone when necessary, whereas we can never neglect a dog. In particular, a yard or other open areas are fun for them. A golden retriever, though, can acclimate to apartment living in a similar manner. They may thrive in tiny places despite their size, as long as their care demands are met. Naturally, this depends on how much activity they get and how many walks they take each day. They are excellent at settling into new houses because of their adaptability. The ability to adapt to the rhythms of the house and get along with other members of their adopted family depends on having a patient disposition and a steady temperament. For instance, they can be a wonderful match for a family that enjoys sports, but they may also be appropriate for older families with limited mobility. Oh, and they don't bark a lot and are social animals. Your dog must be quiet enough for you to prevent issues with your neighbors, whether you live in an apartment or a residential area. A golden retriever dog is perfect for this because they don't bark a lot, even though they have other ways of expressing their emotions. Golden retrievers also enjoy socializing, whether it is with humans or other animals. 
they enjoy the company of other dogs just as much as they do people. Golden Retrievers don't typically have socialization issues, but they must be properly supervised when they meet new people. Owning a Golden Retriever has undeniably more benefits than drawbacks. However, you should be aware of the difficulties you'll encounter before purchasing a Golden Retriever puppy. Although Golden Retrievers are a stunning breed, they are unquestionably more vulnerable than other dogs to developing certain chronic illnesses. Hip dysplasia, elbow dysplasia, and a few eye disorders are among the most prevalent health conditions affecting this breed. Plus, they are heavy shedders. They shed so much hair that it would be possible to knit a sweater out of it. And this process can repeat itself twice a year. Your carpets, wooden floors, and clothes will be all covered in hair. And your carpets and flooring will be covered in heaps of hair. To keep everything under control, you will need an excellent vacuum cleaner. Additionally, a high quality clothes brush or lint remover would be a wonderful addition to this kit. The fact that the birds enjoy using their hair to construct their nests is a definite perk. These canines are known for their excellent social skills. This makes them one of the greatest breeds for families and children. But there is a drawback to this personality trait. It is fairly rare for golden retrievers to not suffer from loneliness and separation anxiety, even while their owners are only at work. Because of this, they are excellent canine companions for busy households in which there is always someone present. Oh, and they can't live outdoors. Even though golden retrievers were developed over generations to thrive in the great outdoors for activities such as hunting, hiking, and exploring, they are not the type of dogs that can or should spend all of their time outside. They have to go indoors with their folks in order to survive. Golden Retrievers are not the best choice for those who want a dog to keep as an outside companion. Don't count on a Golden Retriever to keep an eye on the neighborhood for you. They will let everyone enter and then direct people towards the best silver. They have the ability to make a startling noise if they hear something out of the ordinary, day or night. But because of how they were bred, these dogs treat everyone as if they were a long lost buddy. Another problem with these doggies is that they can be greedy which makes them prone to overeating. They have a voracious appetite, and with those eyes and persistent pleading for food, they can convince you to give them more than they require. Because Goldens have a propensity towards obesity, it is necessary to disregard the pleading expressions they give off. Finally, they are, to put it mildly, some sneaky little crooks. For some dogs, nothing is secure unless it is fastened down. Anything that they can get their lips around, including shoes, underwear, glasses, remote controllers, socks, and basically everything else can be carried around by them. However, this often leads to a lot of stuff breaking. So be wary and make it a priority to keep everything valuable out of reach. Oh, and if you value your garden above everything else, then don't even think about getting this dog because they are notorious diggers and will make your garden look like it has just been bombed. So that was all the time we had today, folks. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon on your way out. Till then, see ya.